Hey guys, uh, today I'm just going to do a rundown of the uh, best available Cydia jailbreak apps and tweaks that are available for the iPhone. Um, two of the major ones are SBS settings and obviously Winterboard. Uh, Winterboard allows you to apply different themes and uh, different settings on your iPhone graphics UI. So you have custom applications and I mean custom images of icons and the uh, user interface which you already know most about and uh, SBS settings is basically a quick way to um, access your settings and uh, other op options uh, without having to go into settings menu so the way you activate it once you install it you just wipe your finger on the top and it gives you these options so you have um, the options of turning off or turning on different um, different uh, applications so for example I can disable my data connections as I have here since I have a jailbroken iPhone and I don't have a contract and you can also enable or disable Wi-Fi, airport and processes SSH like a whole bunch of other ones you can control your brightness of the phone which is a pretty good feature and you can also get your IP address right there instead of having to go into uh, settings and Wi-Fi it's available right there in case you have to do an SSH so that's uh, one of the good features of it and this is also available in the uh, lock screen so when you lock it and you swipe your finger there it should also pop up over there so that's one of the other one and when the second one is uh, obviously winterboard which allows you to apply custom themes and applications so for instance I can do this and it'll go ahead and respring the uh, phone So as you can see, the uh, icons have changed and uh, the UI is also different. So, like that. Uh, a lot of them are available for free, of course, and there are a few high quality ones that you, uh, that you do have to pay for. This one was available for free, so I was able to get it. One of the best texting apps, actually, jailbroken uh, texting apps, is called uh, Byte SMS, which you can download for. Um, free, but you do it gives it's a trial version. You do have to pay for the license, but you can get it for free. There are other ways, but it's up to you. Uh, it's right there. So basically, what that allows you to do is um, it allows you to uh, access the text messages wherever you are, whichever application that's open. The pop-up that comes in allows you to actually edit or reply the message right there without having to open the messages app also I would like to let you know that the uh, Byte SMS software is having problems with the iPhone 4 for some reason like um, I can't seem to get it to work on my iPhone 4 but uh, it does work on 3G, 3GS and all the uh, other phones alright so the next app that we're going to talk about is Installs which is basically a free app store it allows you to download uh, applications from the app uh, that are available in the app store for free and this is the one basically it gives you all the categories and uh, games entertainment utilities all the applications you can download for free basically um, the way you install this is uh, you go to Cydia and you have to install an add-on so the way which is right here hackulo.us so this is the uh, address cydia.hackulo.us and just install in, um, the installers package and uh, it should be uh, working for you the next one I would like to talk about is iFile which is basically an iPhone browser which lets you browse all the files uh, on your iPhone as if you were using a computer so this is very handy in case you want to like store files or store images or movies on your phone. It lets you copy paste files, it lets you rename files, so basically it kind of completes your phone into becoming uh, a full-fledged computer. So that's one of my favorite uh, apps in uh, the uh, jailbreak uh, stores. Alright, so next we'll talk about some of the tweaks that are available, which, which um, 
which uh, modified the uh, phone user interface. So one of the best ones is the called No Spot, available through Big Boss. So basically what that does is it disables the spotlight feature. So when I swipe my finger this way, that spotlight does not show up because I simply don't see any reason to use the uh, spotlight. It's absolutely inconvenient and I hate it. So that's one of the good tweaks you can download. The second tweak is a uh, landscape rotate lock. So that what basically does is the rotation lock available normally only does it portrait. However, if you're sideways and you can now do a landscape rotate, not just the um, portrait rotate. So if I open up right here, I open up a new page and I want to do this and I can just click lock now it won't turn the other way either so this is one of the good apps in case you uh, have in case you're particular about your rotation position the next tweak is this the UI tweak does, that allows me to do this thing with the icons this is called barrel uh, there are a couple options if you go into settings there is a uh, right here, so it gives you a few options or a few graphics uh, graphic types. So you have cube and paste light up and down. So if I do cube inside, and you don't need to respring for it, it applies it right away. So it gives it that 3D page effect or a box effect. So if I do a cube outside, it makes it makes it look like a cube on the outside. And page slide down, but this is by far my favorite. Okay. This one I'm going to be talking about is called Unlim Videos. This application allow you, allows you to um, download and view movies and TV shows um, right from their website. Um, the good thing about it, you can actually download them and watch them later in case you don't have a data connection or you're not on contract like I am so this is a really good app I suggest that you do sign up for their website like uh, just make a register for their website and make a username and password um, the, one of the best sites available is the first one is called i4 iPhones they do have the latest and greatest movies and TV shows available so you can download them right away and they also have other ebooks and a whole bunch of other software that you can download easily so the next one I want to talk about is called OpenSSH. This is basically a file transfer application that allows you to swap files or copy files from your phone onto your um, computer over a Wi-Fi network. And if you're using a laptop, you can actually create a network, like an ad hoc network, and connect the uh, phone to the computer that way as well. Another app that I want to talk about is called LockInfo, which is basically... Um, a notification system on your lock screen that gives you previews to different application different applications um, right down your lock screen so for example right here you can view the uh, weather and uh, uh, mail and SMS uh, message previews right on your lock screen without having to open up the uh, app itself uh, it's pretty handy um, gives you a whole bunch of options you can actually enable it on your home screen as well as the lock screen uh, I do recommend that you get it um, it's a pretty good app um, another tweak is called uh, direct closer pro which works in the multitasking area it gives you these um, buttons to close the application directly from here um, instead of having to hold it down wait for it to shake and then close it that way so basically if I wanted to close something it would give me these options I can close the app right there right away it's a pretty easy um, um, tweak and I do recommend that you install it so I hope you guys like this video um, of Cydia apps and tweaks um, if you have any other questions please leave a comment and if you would like me to review anything else or if you want to know more about jailbreaking please uh, let me know I'll try to put up uh, more videos thanks for watching